Let me show you how to make a link page in Unicode. Hey everyone, how's it going? It's Jewel Tolentino here from Esatino Media. And on this channel, we show you how to create profitable content. All right, so if you don't know what a link page is, this is it right here, you're looking at it. So it is a mobile friendly, I would say it's like a website and a business card mixed together because you've got this beautifully designed mini website like for the mobile but at the same time it acts like a business card because it has information for your business and you can i'll quickly scroll down here and you can see some of the quick templates here and then we'll dive right into the tutorial all right so first thing you want to do is when you log in to your unicode dashboard head over to the left hand side to link pages and from here this is where we're going to create a mobile friendly link in bio page with multiple links now the cool thing about this is you can have either a link and or a qr code and you can place this link like in your instagram or in your facebook profile linkedin profile wherever it allows you to place a link you can place this link and also you can have a qr code on your phone when you're at business networking events and you can have people scan this QR code and have this really cool looking page pop up. All right, so once we're here, we're gonna click create link page. Now from here, they're going to have a bunch of featured templates. So this could actually get you started and then you can change things up. So you can change the colors, change the text, add a different photo. I think for this example, I'm going to choose this one right here. It's for a gym, but I can totally customize it and change it up. I do like that it has the social media links down at the bottom. So I'm just going to click on it. And so the cool thing is, is that Unicode makes it really easy to customize this. So I'm just going to go through this whole thing and add my stuff to this. So the first one here to customize is this logo here up at the top, which shows right here. So I want to change it to my business logo. So I'm just going to click on the pencil icon and change that up. Okay, so from here I'm going to go over to upload and then I'm going to find the logo and put it in here. I'm just going to actually make it smaller. I could potentially make this a little bit smaller, but for this tutorial I'll keep it. And then from here I'm going to change it to our business name, Esatino Media. And then I'm going to type in YouTube Marketing. You can also change the font here. For now, I'm going to leave it as is. For this one though, I am going to make things a little bit smaller so we can get it on one line. There we go. So let's continue on customizing here. I'm not sure if I like this gray color, but we'll leave it for now and we'll see how it looks. All right, and now we're going to customize these buttons here. So we're going to put something like website. And then we'll enter in our website here and you can change this to no image icon or thumbnail but i want to leave it like this next is the workout videos i'll put youtube channel so i'm going to paste in our youtube channel link and then here it has location i actually want to remove that okay so i'm gonna x out of this and remove that and from here you can add more social media links so you can see that the default is YouTube, Instagram, and TikTok, but you can also add, you know, Facebook, X, LinkedIn, Snapchat, all these, or even like a PayPal donation link. So I'm just going to click X out of this one. And I'm just going to keep the YouTube one here because some people, you know, they'll click on this or they could click on this. And essentially we do want people going to our YouTube channel. So I'm actually going to keep it like this. I find that the less options, the better. And I'm okay with both of these promoting the YouTube channel. Okay, so when that looks good, you want to click next step. Okay, so from here, you want to choose your background. So we can actually change this up. We want to remove what's currently on here. And then we can either do a solid color or an image. So I'm going to remove this. I'm going to keep it really simple. And let's see what solid color looks like. So you can choose your branding colors. I'm just creating a simple one here. And then you can also alter the font 
if you have a specific font that you use for your branding, and then the style of button. So right now it's set to this, but I can change it to this or this. I might change it to this, but then want to change the color of the buttons. I think I want to keep it simple and make the buttons white. Once you're done with that, click next step. So this is going to give you an auto-generated link, page link, and I'm going to change the name of this, Esatino Media, so we know what it is. Let's click on advanced settings. So you can have all these things where you can turn on enable GPS location analytics. You can schedule a start and end date if the, for the campaign. You can also make this password protected. I'm not sure what this is. And then here we have retargeting. This is if you upgrade, you can also input your Facebook pixel. That's if you're doing like Facebook ads and stuff like that. And then also if you do Google AdWords. So I believe I'm done and I'm gonna click finish. All right, so it says your link page is ready. You can see this is the link that they provided you. You can also create a QR code to go along with this. All right, so I just sent myself the link on my phone. I'm gonna click on it right now. And then boom, there you go. You've got a very nice, very sleek looking link page, mobile link page here that you can easily attach onto your Instagram bio, your Facebook profile, LinkedIn profile, wherever you can add this link. And again, remember, you can also create a QR code that attaches onto this so that people can scan and get this. Now, this is very sleek, simple, and you click on website, make sure you're inputting the correct links. And then boom, it goes to our website. If I go back and click on our YouTube channel, boom, there we go. We got them on our YouTube channel. Generally speaking, when we do go to networking events, we do want people to go to our YouTube channel because we feel that video is much more powerful. So we actually want them to go to the channel, watch our videos, get a feel for our energy, get a feel for our personality, and that actually sells them more than our website. So that is it. That is how you create a beautiful, simple, sleek link page in Unicode. If you guys want to create one yourself, you guys can head down to the description below. We'll have a link for you to try it out. You can start your free trial and design your first link page. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next video.